So we've done another Korean lesson today. We started with numbers. I'm doing it inside my home, uh, inside my house, because they're busy cutting grass and next, uh, next to us. Our neighbors are busy cutting grass. So I'm trying to not get that caught on camera. Um, we did numbers today, and the big thing, let me just switch hands. The big thing, all right, the big thing is that I thought it would be the easier numbers that they teach us, right? It would be the easier numbers that they teach us. And it wasn't. It was the e hop, a hop, yodol, shin something. And I'm like, why didn't you, why didn't they teach me the new, the easier numbers first? Hopefully we get to the easier numbers. And the, and the, and, and, and the, the challenge of this all is simply they use the numbers in sentences. You know, I thought they would like literally start us off like this is one through 10 and this is 20, 30, 40. And the, this is how you do, this is how you combine the stuff. No, 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 no. They just go, oh, this woman is 38 years old. And you're like, okay. So I might have to do a little bit of research on how the numbering system works. The other numbering system. Um, I know the Il Isamsa or Yuchilpa. You know, I know those. But the other ones I never bothered to learn. Because essentially I could... The Koreans would laugh at me. But I could at least tell them how old I was, even if I was using the wrong numbering system. But I guess that's part of learning. So yeah, that was quite a difficult one. And uh, But I'm still going strong. I'm going to learn it. And I'm going to master it. Anyway, thank you everybody for joining. And I'll see you in the next one. I might have to learn how to count in the different way. I still don't know what's the difference between the two the two numbering systems in Korea, and I don't know why they're using it, but I might have to learn the other way to count. Oh, because this is difficult. Because they go, and then it's like, oh, 90, they count down from 90 back to 10. And I'm like, what? What? I don't know this. If it was the other counting system, oh, fuck, it's dark. If it was the other counting system, I would have figured it out. You know, il e samsa o yuk chil pal gu. And I think is man. I think I. Meh. But anyway, um, no, man is a thousand. But yeah, I might have to learn to count in a different way in Korea now. I'll probably do it tomorrow. I'll look at it today and then hopefully I can implement it. But uh, yeah, thank you everybody for watching. This is my struggles with counting in Korean. Hopefully they go to the easier route in the next couple of lessons but right now counting is a bit difficult so uh hopefully i can sort it out and uh i will see you in the next video keep on keeping on and stuff and things and stuff hey there hey there oh no vampire today oh. that's not what i wanted to say um good day good day good day welcome to another korean update um, didn't sleep a lot last night. I probably slept about three hours. Uh, just a little bit of stress on, uh, uh, just a little bit of stress screwing me over a bit, but I didn't sleep a, a lot. And, uh, that made, <laughs> that made the Korean lesson a little bit more difficult today. Not gonna lie. It made, oh, let me switch again. It made the Korean lesson a little bit more difficult today. And it was like, imagine, imagine you're sitting in a stats class or a math class in school, but you didn't sleep well the previous night. And it's important shit you need to learn. So it's numbers and important shit, and I'm tired. So, uh, yeah, it didn't stick as well. I was sitting there going, oh, come on. I was like making the same mistakes over and over and over again. But I did it. I, where I would usually do like three parts, four parts if I'm well rested and everything. I did two parts today, but it took me half an hour of the lesson. What's the thing we learned from this? Sleep. Yeah, sleep. Uh, but uh, yeah, that was it. And I will see you in the next one. Keep on keeping on. And thank you for those comments on the videos, by the way. Just saying. Thank you.
Good day, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another Korean update video. This one's going to be reasonably quick. Look at that clean, that clean pool. But this one's going to be reasonably quick. Uh, still did numbers. It's. I don't know if it's the fact that it's numbers that I'm struggling with. The fact that it's just simple numbers. It's one of those things where I'm like, oh, my dogs are going crazy. Oh, you can't really see the other one, but the other one is right there. Um, I don't know if it's just the fact that it's numbers, but numbers are the problem for me when I'm counting, especially when it's not the easier Korean system. I think it's called Sino-Korean. Um, it's the original Korean numbers that I'm struggling with. The, easy, the Sino Korean, the moment I get to that, those part of the numbers, you'll be like, I'll be like, oh, cool. I went through everything now. Uh, so I'm giving it about another two days uh, with the numbers. And we're struggling. I'm struggling. He listens to 74 radios today. It's literally where he listens to 74 radios, where in my mind it would be Onul Kunyanin Radio. No, no, no. It's not that. It is Kunyanin or Kunyan Onul Radio 74 Tarul Durayo or Durayo, whatever. And it's difficult, you know. Um, but yeah, the numbers are a thing that I'm struggling with. Hopefully, I can get past it real quick. Um, but yeah, I'm still doing it, 74, um, 74 radios. This is now, okay, so on Duolingo, they keep track. Let me just tell you about that. They keep track of how many days in a row you study Korean. Now, I just hit 60 days today, but, but it's been longer, mainly because I have skipped a couple of days, but I did make up for it by doing two lessons in one day. So it's been longer. I mean, it's, uh, I started this journey in July. I started this journey in July of this year. So it's about 90 odd days, probably. But the streak has been 60 days. Let's see if we can keep the streak up for 100 days. But uh, anyway, yeah, that's me rambling. And uh, yeah, thank you everybody for watching. And I'll see you in the next video.